This sign is still a continuous, like, observe silence. This was freshman F, right? Dog. This was freshman F. Yeah, this is freshman F. I remember being here and everything was faced in this way. And the reason why this is significant... I know. Ooh. Wow, look at this place. The lockers, the air conditioning, these modern desks and stuff. And clearly we will never have these type of TVs. This is and this kind of funky board stuff. One of the greatest memories and, and the highlights is in this classroom particularly is number one. I was given the gift of the Celestine Prophecy, uh, which changed my outlook on knowing what the world is about. And number two, um, learning about entrepreneurship at such an early age. Being 17, 18 and learning that you can hustle, that's pretty cool. I learned the value of entrepreneurship, which is kind of funny, I, you know, not really knowing what entrepreneurship was, but I had a classmate that was hustling. She sold snacks that she hid in her cubby hole and sold it to classmates and she got the new stuff from the market in the morning and then sold it at, in class. And even though she had patong or she had added a little bit more you know, uh, money on top of that, because she did the service of actually bringing it here, it almost gave her the right to obviously sell it more. But also along these hallowed corridors is where the book, The Celestine Prophecy, was given to me by, by my friend, Dean de Fernando. Um, it was, it, that changed my life. It really changed my outlook of how to look at the world very differently. And even though I took about a year to really finish that book, it made me realize that we are all in this world in a bigger purpose that's really right in front of us. I think this being obviously a Catholic school and, and the Los Alian brothers teach you that service aspect and to be a Christian uh, in the grander scheme of things. But I, I had an opening with regards to spirituality and interconnection of human beings through that book. So anyways, let's move forward.